Okay, I think it's time to talk about the 800-pound elephant in the room. Uh, you know, every decade or so, there's a miracle weight loss drug that comes on the market. So unless you've been living under a rock somewhere, uh, I'm sure you've heard of Ozempic. Now, uh, I'm curious about Ozempic. It is a drug for type 2 diabetes. And the off-label use is for weight loss. Uh, people have been having some remarkable results with this drug. And uh, I got curious. I, I decided I was going to do some of my own research and see what's really going on on the street. Okay, so I joined a couple of Ozempic weight loss groups on Facebook. And uh, some very interesting posts... Uh, on these groups are going to talk about their weight loss experience. Some people lose weight immediately on the lowest dose. The lowest dose is what you're on for about the first four weeks. That low dose is to get your body used to the potential side effects of the drug. And uh, side effects, let's talk about that. Uh, people report having diarrhea, constipation, Nausea, cramps, uh, somebody said they went to work and did number two in their pants. Uh, I don't know. I, you know, I, I, that seems kind of extreme to me. Other people talk about their appetite disappears so much that they can only eat two or three bites of their meal. Now, um, how healthy is that? you can only eat two or three bites, what, what's happening to your nutrition? Yes, of course you're going to lose weight. There's no way around it. I mean, people are reporting hundreds of pounds they've lost on this drug. Within a year, I think a lady lost 150 pounds. 150 pounds, that's like a whole person. Okay, congratulations and more power to you. What happens, do you stay on the drug the rest of your life? Or do you go off the drug? Does the drug eventually not work for you? I mean, do you like get immune to it? Or let me pose this question, and let's ponder this a little bit. Is there a placebo effect from this drug? And when I say a placebo effect, you can achieve similar results going on keto. Upping your protein intake, you're uh, getting rid of carbs and sugar, and you're going to have a diminished appetite, too. Um, you're not going to be thinking about food all the time when you get the carbs and sugar out of your life. I mean, I've experienced that myself. Now, I don't have any beef with people taking Ozempic. Uh, I know I've struggled with my weight my whole life, and people get to the point of desperation where they're going to try anything. And... Uh, I hope it works. I hope it works for anybody that wants to get it. Now, the other thing is, what is wrong with these insurance companies not covering this drug for people that want to lose weight? You know, obesity is a killer. Um, people write about getting their prescriptions from Canada. And by the way, let me tell you that an injection pen, uh, which probably has maybe four to six weeks worth of injections, um, is running anywhere from a thousand to twelve hundred dollars out of pocket if you're not covered by insurance. Uh, it's shameful to me and uh, it's, it's shameful that anybody that's trying to improve their health that the insurance companies would deny. Insurance companies in this country have too much power. It's simple. And, uh, you know, maybe I've been uh, listening to Bernie Sanders since about 2015. The guy's right, okay? The insurance companies. Uh, if we had universal health care, let me digress. If you live in Canada, you can probably go get the prescription, and it's probably covered, okay? Living here in the U.S., there are people ordering online from Canada, so they don't have to pay more than about three or four hundred dollars out of pocket 
to get the Ozempic. Uh, and there you go. It's shameful that the insurance companies in this country are doing that. In fact, that drug is way too expensive. Okay, so um, that's my that's my take on Ozempic. Um, if you're taking Ozempic for weight loss, it'd be great if you'd chime in in the uh, comments and let us know how you're doing. Um, I have a confession. I'm gonna. I should have said this at the beginning of the video, but I'm on Ozempic too. Um, I took my third injection. I'll be taking my fourth injection um, the day after tomorrow. So far, I haven't lost any weight. Okay, my appetite is diminished on some days. On other days, I want to eat everything in sight. So I'm just hoping that when I up the dosage. Uh, I see a suppressed appetite. Uh, in the meantime, this is Sue702. I'll keep you updated on my progress on Ozempic, and um, it would be great if you're taking, like I said, if you're taking the drug yourself for weight loss, let us know how you're doing. Let's keep the conversation going. And uh, if, you, if there's any other topics you want to discuss, let me know in the comments. And uh, thanks for watching my video today. This is Sue702. I'll be talking to you again soon. And uh, I'll update you on my progress. Have a great day, everyone. Bye.